What do you make of this twist? Many didn't see it coming, did you? No, I, no neither do I. But the point is that maybe it's well enough because he discharged himself from the hospital. My own concern is that does that mean that hospital doesn't have a private wing whereby he will have a room to himself, he will be able to have some visitors. That is possible. But the point is that the hospital is in a difficult position because the, uh, patients have the right to discharge themselves. There's no big deal and about that. And that's a standard in every hospital. That's a standard in hospital. And in some hospital, they have what they call self-discharge policy, Absolutely. whereby these doctors must follow. And when the doctors are considering either to detain or let the patient go, there are two criteria which they need to take into account. Is the patient an adult? Number one, is he capable of making a decision? Mental uh, 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 Yes. Now, uh, now, the exception now comes in whereby you can detain them and said look you can't go because Where will number that arise? one okay. that will arise those are the exception whereby number one that patient is going to be a risk to himself or herself that is one and Health number wise. two it's wise okay. because don't forget it may well be some of them have undergone a serious chemotherapy and then they said, oh, I'm going home now. So their fundamental By the time they go out, then there will be okay. a problem. Okay. Then there are certain situations whereby that patient has a mental disorder okay. and they cannot take a decision. Mm -hmm. In which case, you have to detain them in the hospital. And then the third point is that whether it is in the p interest of that patient to remain in the hospital so that the treatment can just continue. So, or in the worst scenario, you apply to the court to detain. In this case now, it appears that the sheikh must have fulfilled it all. They felt he was uh, sound enough to have made that decision. Uh, exactly. And, and it's not a risk. Yes, it's not a risk to himself. And then it's well enough to take, uh, sorry, it's mentally sound enough to take a decision about his well-being. This sorry. is a sick man and it's going by the reports that the medical the medical report at least six to seven doctors and uh, we believe that this is those reports were what guided the judge against in the will granting. of the government in granting him so what happens was there a, a deceit somewhere if I'm, it's even lucky to have a benevolent judge because if I'm the judge, number one, you're in breach of your bail condition because, because the, the, the bail know, condition. The, the court was adjourned, the case was adjourned. The case um, was adjourned so that you can undergo court without medical, the dates medical in mind, treatment. Right, so. And for you to discharge yourself and return back to Nigeria, it is either you are well enough or the alternative is that you can receive the treatment locally. And now you can face the consequence of your action.